Hello and welcome to Canadian Citizenship Test Preparation YouTube channel. In this channel you can find latest update and study material for Canadian Citizenship Test. Hope you find our video and study material helpful. Good luck on your test. If you learned something today please press the subscribe button. What is the capital of Canada? The answer is Ottawa. What did the suffrage movement achieve? The answer is women obtained the right to vote. What is the most popular religion in Canada? The answer is Christians. Which Canadian province is the largest producer of oil and natural gas? The answer is Alberta. What principles is Canada's constitution based on? The answer is peace, order and good government. Who is above the law in Canada? The answer is no one. Which provincial flag features the fleur-de-lis? The answer is Quebec. Who led an armed uprising and seized Fort Garry? The answer is Louis Riel. Who were the United Empire Loyalists? The answer is settlers who came to Canada from the United States during the American Revolution. Who were the voyagers? The answer is Montreal-based traders who traveled by canoe. What does due process mean? The answer is the government must respect all the legal rights a person is entitled to under the law. Why is trade with other countries important to Canada? The answer is it enhances our economy and raises our standard of living. Who is the Premier of Ontario? The answer is Doug Ford. Which level of government is responsible for by-laws? The answer is municipal. When did Nunavut become a territory? The answer is April 1, 1999. What is the other name of Great Charter of Freedoms? The answer is Magna Carta. Which provinces in Canada is known as the bread basket of the world and also as the wheat province? The answer is Saskatchewan. What is the capital city of Manitoba? The answer is Winnipeg. What are the prime minister and cabinet ministers together called? The answer is the cabinet. Who is the federal representative of Canada's monarch? The answer is the Governor-General of Canada. Who is Canada's head of state? The answer is Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. How many Canadians served in World War II? The answer is more than one million. Which province has a long history of coal mining, forestry, and agriculture? The answer is Nova Scotia. After a federal election, which party forms the new government? 
The answer is the party with the most elected representatives is invited by the Governor General to become the party in power. Approximately how many Canadians served in the First World War? The answer is more than 600,000. Canada has three territories and how many provinces? The answer is 10. Fatima is a new immigrant in Canada. What law allows her to take a job at par with a man? The answer is equality of women and men. In Canada, are you allowed to question the police about their service or conduct? The answer is yes, if you feel the need to. What does it mean to say Canada is a constitutional monarchy? The answer is Canada's head of state is a hereditary sovereign, queen or king, who reigns in accordance with the constitution. What does the right to a secret ballot mean? The answer is no one can watch your vote and no one should look at how you voted. What does the term, responsible government, mean? The answer is the ministers of the crown must have the support of a majority of the elected representatives in order to govern. What is a francophone? The answer is a person who speaks French as their first language. What is a voter information card? The answer is a form that tells you when and where to vote. What is meant by the equality of women and men? The answer is men and women are equal under the law. What is the difference between the role of the sovereign and that of the prime minister? The answer the sovereign is the guardian of constitutional freedoms, the prime minister selects the cabinet ministers and is responsible for operations and policy of government. What should you do if you do not receive a voter information card telling you when and where to vote? The answer is call Elections Canada or visit their website. When asked, who must you tell how you voted in a federal election? The answer is no one. When did the British North America Act come into effect? The answer is 1867. When did the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms become part of the Canadian Constitution? The answer is 1982. Where does Canada rank in the world's largest countries? The answer is second. Which party becomes the official opposition? The answer is the party with the second most MPs. Which province was split into two at Confederation? The answer is the province of Canada. Which province was the first to grant voting rights to women? The answer is, Manitoba. What is the capital city of Canada? The answer is, Ottawa. Where are the parliament buildings located? The answer is Ottawa. How is a cabinet minister chosen? The answer is by the prime minister. What is the capital city of Ontario? The answer is Toronto.
In the 1960s, Quebec experienced an era of rapid change. What is this called? The answer is the Quiet Revolution. Name two responsibilities of the federal government? The answer is national defense and foreign policy. Which was the last province to join Canada? The answer is Newfoundland. A member of parliament from Vancouver announces that she will spend her weekend in her electoral district. This means she would be the answer is in some part of Vancouver where she was elected. What part of the Constitution legally protects the basic rights and freedoms of all Canadians? The answer is the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms. Which federal political party is in power? 2022. The answer is Liberal Party. What is the role of the opposition parties? The answer is to oppose or try to improve government proposals. When is Remembrance Day celebrated? The answer is November 11. What types of cases are heard by the Federal Court of Canada? The answer is matters concerning the federal government. What does the term, Inuit, mean? The answer is the people. What are the three main types of industry in Canada? The answer is natural resources, manufacturing and services. How are senators chosen? The answer is senators are appointed by the Governor General on the advice of the Prime Minister. What is the meaning of the Remembrance Day poppy? The answer is to remember the sacrifice of Canadians who have served or died in wars up to the present day. Who is Sir Louis Hippolyte Lafontaine? The answer is the first head of a responsible government in Canada. Where are the remains of the first settlement known as Lonceau Meadows? The answer is Newfoundland and Labrador. Who is Canada's largest trading partner? The answer is the United States. The Peace Tower of the Parliament Buildings was completed in 1927 in honor of? The answer is the First World War. The term Aboriginal peoples refers to? The answer is Indian, Inuit, Métis. Which province has the largest Aboriginal population? The answer is Manitoba. What is referred to as Central Canada? The answer is Ontario, Quebec. Which legal document underlines the importance of multiculturalism? The answer is the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms. What province has its own time zone? The answer is Newfoundland and Labrador. What is the capital of Saskatchewan? The answer is Regina. Who chose Ottawa as the capital of Canada? The answer is Queen Victoria. What is the role of the courts in Canada? The answer is to settle disputes.
the Crown is a symbol of? The answer is police services and the Canadian forces. Government, Parliament and legislatures. The courts. During the War of 1812 the Americans burned down the Parliament buildings in York, now Toronto. What did the British and Canadians do in return? The answer is they burned down the White House in Washington, D.C. Name the five Great Lakes? The answer is Erie, Huron, Michigan, Ontario and Superior. What is known as the Great Upheaval? The answer is when Acadians were deported during the war between Britain and France. In Canada's justice system what does presumption of innocence mean? The answer is everyone is innocent until proven guilty. From where does the name Canada come from? The answer is from Kanada, the Huron Iroquois word for village. Name one source of Canadian law? The answer is English common law. What is Magna Carta? The answer is the Great Charter of Freedoms. The Great Charter of Freedoms was signed in? The answer is England. When was the Magna Carta signed? The answer is 1215. What does the Great Charter of Freedom include? The answer is the right to live and work anywhere in Canada. When was the Constitution of Canada amended to include the Charter of Rights and Freedoms? The answer is 1982. Who proclaimed the amended Constitution of Canada in 1982? The answer is Queen Elizabeth II. What are the two principles upon which Canada is founded? The answer is the supremacy of God and the rule of law. What are mobility rights? The answer is mobility rights allow individuals to move from place to place, largely free from government intervention. Who can enter and leave the country freely without time constraints? The answer is Canadian citizens. Which three rights are included in the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms? The answer is mobility rights, Aboriginal people's rights, and official language rights. Canadians work hard to respect? The answer is pluralism. What is a fundamental characteristic of the Canadian heritage and identity? The answer is multiculturalism. When called to do so, serving on a jury is. The answer is a legal requirement. What is a noble way to contribute to Canada and an excellent career choice? The answer is serve in the regular Canadian forces. Who in 1864 suggested the name, Dominion of Canada? The answer is Samuel Leonard Tilley. Who has the right to run as a candidate in federal elections? The answer is any Canadian citizen who is at least 18 years old.
Who are the Acadians? The answer is the descendants of French colonists who began settling in what are now the Maritime Provinces in 1604. Which region of Canada is known for both its fertile agricultural land and valuable energy resources? The answer is Prairie Provinces. Who was Sir Sam Steele? The answer is a great frontier hero, mounted policeman and soldier of the Queen. Who is the Queen's representative in Canada? The answer is Governor General of Canada. Which province is the only officially bilingual province? The answer is New Brunswick. Name the five regions of Canada? The answer is the Atlantic Provinces, Central Canada, the Prairie Provinces, the West Coast, the Northern Territories. Give an example of where English and French have equal status in Canada? The answer is in the Parliament of Canada. What is the Queen's representative in the territories called? The answer is Commissioner. Where do the majority of Francophones live? The answer is Quebec. What percentage of Aboriginal people are First Nations? The answer is 65%. How many judges serve in the Supreme Court of Canada? The answer is 9. Who started the Marathon of Hope? The answer is Terry Fox. Who is considered Canada's greatest soldier? The answer is General Sir Arthur Currie. What was the main trade of the first companies formed in Canada? The answer is the fur trade. For how long was the title Dominion of Canada officially used? The answer is 100 years. What designs are on a 25 cents quarter? The answer is caribou. In the early days, what form of transportation did Aboriginal peoples and fur traders use? The answer is waterways. British Columbia is known as Canada's Pacific Gateway because? The answer is billions of dollars in products are shipped to and from Asia. Which is Canada's largest city and main financial centre? The answer is Toronto. People from which country played a significant role in the building of the Canadian Pacific Railway? The answer is China. How many territories does Canada have? The answer is three. Since 1854, how many Canadians have been awarded the Victoria Cross? The answer is 96. How does a bill become law? The answer is approval by a majority in the House of Commons and Senate and finally the Governor General. Is dictatorship Canada's system of government? The answer is no. Which three countries are signatories to NAFTA? The answer is Canada, Mexico and the United States. What do you call the sovereign's representative in the provinces? The answer is Lieutenant Governor.
Which province in Canada is the smallest in land size? The answer is Prince Edward Island. What does the word Inuit mean? The answer is the people in the Inuktitut language. List three ways you can protect the environment? The answer is recycle, conserve energy and water and join a carpool. What do you promise when you take the oath of citizenship? The answer is to pledge your loyalty to the sovereign, Queen Elizabeth II. What is the Underground Railroad? The answer is a network used by slaves who escaped the United States into Canada. What was the head tax? The answer is a discriminatory race-based entry fee to Canada. Who was Louis Riel? The answer is a Métis leader and the father of Manitoba. What is the significance of the discovery of insulin by Frederick Banting and Charles Best? The answer is the discovery has saved 16 million people worldwide. When does an election have to be held according to the Constitution? The answer is every four years following the most recent general election. How many electoral districts are there in Canada? The answer is 338. What do Canadians normally wear on Remembrance Day? The answer is a red poppy. Which is the highest court of Canada? The answer is the Supreme Court. How many citizens of Canada served in the Second World War? The answer is 1 million. What will you promise when you take the oath of citizenship? The answer is pledge allegiance to the Queen, observe the laws of Canada and fulfill the duties of a Canadian. Why is the Battle of Vimy Ridge important? The answer is Canadian Corps secured its reputation for valor and bravery. When is Canada Day and what does it celebrate? The answer is we celebrate the anniversary of Confederation July 1st of each year. What is a major river in Quebec? The answer is St. Lawrence River. What did the Canadian Pacific Railway symbolize? The answer is unity. What do you call a law before it is passed? The answer is a bill. How is a cabinet minister chosen? The answer is by the prime minister. Who are the Acadians? The answer is, the descendants of French colonists who began settling in what are now the Maritime Provinces in 1604. What is the largest religious affiliation in Canada? The answer is, Catholic. What is the government of all of Canada called? The answer is, constitutional monarchy and a parliamentary democracy. What does the Canadian flag look like? The answer is, white with a red border on each end and a red maple leaf in the center. What did the Fathers of Confederation do? The answer is, they worked together to establish a new country, the Dominion of Canada. In which region do more than half the people in Canada live? The answer is, Central Canada.
Give an example of how you can show responsibility by participating in your community? The answer is, volunteer. In what industry do most Canadians work? The answer is, service. What is meant by the equality of women and men? The answer is, men and women are equal under the law. Canada has three territories and how many provinces? The answer is, 10. Where are the Great Lakes? The answer is, southern Ontario along the border between Canada and the United States. Who are the Aboriginal peoples in Canada? The answer is, the first inhabitants of Canada. What three oceans border Canada? The answer is, Pacific, Arctic and Atlantic. Which province is the only officially bilingual province? The answer is, New Brunswick. How many provinces and territories are there in Canada? The answer is, 10 provinces and 3 territories. From where does the name, Canada, come? The answer is, from, Kanada, the Iroquoian word for village. What is written on an election ballot? The answer is, the names of the candidates in your electoral district. In what year did Canada become a country? The answer is, 1867. What do you mark on a federal election ballot? The answer is an X. What is the name of the Royal Anthem of Canada? The answer is God Save the Queen, King. What is the population of Canada? The answer is about 34 million people. Which province is Canada's largest producer of hydroelectricity? The answer is Quebec. What is meaning of the Canadian coat of arms and motto, Amari Usque Ad Mare? The answer is from sea to sea. Why are the Great Lakes important to Canada? The answer is fresh water and waterways. What principle was Canada's constitution founded on? The answer is peace, order and good government. What are the two official languages of Canada? The answer is English and French. Who appoints the judges of the Supreme Court of Canada? The answer is the Governor General. What is the capital city of Canada? The answer is Ottawa. Which of the following is the responsibility of the provincial governments? The answer is highways. What did the suffrage movement achieve? The answer is women obtained the right to vote. Which Canadian province is the largest producer of oil and natural gas? The answer is Alberta. The following is above the law in Canada? The answer is no one. What is the significance of hockey? The answer is it is the most popular spectator sport in Canada and is also its national winter sport.
Who governs Canada on the federal level? The answer is Prime Minister. What is the highest honor a Canadian can receive? The answer is the Victoria Cross. What are the three branches of the Canadian government? The answer is executive, legislative, and judicial. Member of Parliament from Winnipeg decides to spend the weekend in his or her electoral district. This means the MP will be. The answer is in the part of Winnipeg where the MP was elected. What is the significance of the Quebec Act of 1774? The answer is Canada's tolerance towards all religions was affected. Where does Canada rank in the world's largest countries? The answer is second. Which party becomes the official opposition? The answer is the party with the second most MPs. Which province was split into two at Confederation? The answer is the province of Canada. Which province was the first to grant voting rights to women? The answer is Manitoba. What is the capital city of Canada? The answer is, Ottawa. Where are the Parliament buildings located? The answer is Ottawa. How is a cabinet minister chosen? The answer is by the Prime Minister. What is the capital city of Ontario? The answer is Toronto. In the 1960s, Quebec experienced an era of rapid change. What is this called? The answer is the Quiet Revolution. Name two responsibilities of the federal government. The answer is national defense and foreign policy. Which was the last province to join Canada? The answer is Newfoundland. A member of parliament from Vancouver announces that she will spend her weekend in her electoral district. This means she would be the answer is in some part of Vancouver where she was elected. What part of the Constitution legally protects the basic rights and freedoms of all Canadians? The answer is the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms. Which federal political party is in power? 2022. The answer is Liberal Party. What is the role of the opposition parties? The answer is to oppose or try to improve government proposals. When is Remembrance Day celebrated? The answer is November 11. What types of cases are heard by the Federal Court of Canada? The answer is matters concerning the federal government. What does the term, Inuit, mean? The answer is the people. What are the three main types of industry in Canada? The answer is natural resources, manufacturing and services. How are senators chosen? The answer is senators are appointed by the Governor-General on the advice of the Prime Minister.